Isn't science wonderful? I just love to study these subjects like spectrometry and uh, spectronic balancing and uh, spectrographs and uh, anything that has the word uh, uh, spectrochemistry of all kinds, anything that has the word spectro in it. I even like the acronym SPECT. Uh, it stands for Single Photon Emission computed tomography <laughs> and uh, and i just ex get excited about the fact that we're able to measure even a single photon like that oh it's just a it's amazing what science can can do and uh and uh the instruments that we have to measure things you know clear down to a single photon and a, a single electron and and so forth and uh so i just get excited about all those kinds of things like that and uh I just love to study spectrums, you know, of all of all kinds. You know, there's a spectrum of light that has a ultraviolet light and a and infrared light and all these other forms of light. And then there's only that real small little place, little spectrum in there that comes visible to our eyes. And you wonder, well, why does the eyes, uh, you know, only see that little small uh, place on the spectrum when the spe spectrum is this wide and just goes on and on uh, actually f with all different kinds of a uh, of a, a light and a energy of every kind uh, just all uh, through uh, uh, all through space it's like that you know just all kinds of energy and light and everything in it and then we just see just a small little uh, spectrum of it but uh, we know all of that other is is uh, through through science and through uh lifting our consciousness to the point of discovering all of these things you know somebody had to ask uh, the questions that i asked about why uh, about what all else is there you know and in order to get to the point where uh, they could begin to discover they had to get curious about what was there you know and that's a that's kind of the scientific method the part of the scientific method is getting curious about what all is there you know so that you uh, have the uh, motivation to begin to search and to seek and to find uh, all of those things that, that which are already there, which we haven't uh, look, haven't begun to uh, measure or detect yet, and uh, that's the same way it is with uh, with all of these uh, other areas of lifting consciousness, lifting consciousness to the world of spirit, and lifting the consciousness to the world of. Uh, of healing and and lifting the, the conscious all forms of healing and all forms of consciousness and uh, we are uh, right now we are just in a small spectrum of consciousness uh, but we are capable of lifting our consciousness to all kinds of uh, uh, different things uh, over a wide spectrum you know uh, way uh, just exactly like uh, what you would uh, think of a uh, a, a spectrum uh, and it, that's the way i always think of it is a spe like you do think of a spectrum of a uh, ultraviolet light and uh, an infrared light and and visible light and all that uh, those other t forms of light, light and heat and uh, radiation and energy and all that well there's all kinds of uh, of uh, of things like that in the air spiritual energy and spiritual light and uh, a healing energy and healing light and it just goes on and on and on and so uh, in this new age, this uh, age which has started now, where uh, consciousness is rising at a geometric rate, like it is, we're beginning to discover uh, spectrums in uh, all kinds of spectrums, not just the light spectrum, but the uh, energy spectrum and consciousness spectrums, and and every every kind of thing uh, area, uh, uh, every kind of spectrum that you can can imagine is all there, and. Uh, not only are the, is the spectrum uh, infinite in width, but there's a <laughs> infinite number of those spectrums, if you can believe that. And so uh, it's exciting when we look toward the future at uh, all of the ways, that, all the new inventions and the new uh, creative activities that, are, that we know will be going on and are already going on, and all of the, of the new devi medical devices which will be uh, discovered, uh, and all of the new... Uh, uh, technology which will be discovered all the new er things in the areas of, of computers which will be discovered and uh, our computers will become uh, thousands of times faster than they are now and uh, and uh, all of our measuring equipment will come faster 
thousands of times faster than it is now, and uh, and it's just there's just no end to it. And and the at the same time, while there's no end to that, there's no end to the, our consciousness being able to rise into all types of realms. And so we know that uh, the combination of our rising consciousness and uh, the and the and the uh, increase in technology is just going to get together, and it's just going to mushroom into a world that is just going to be so extremely prosperous and abundant and full of every good thing until the deserts are going to blossom. Truly, those prophecies about the deserts uh, blooming and blossoming are true because in this age, the way we're discovering things and the way our mind is expanding at a geometric rate, I can easily see those deserts blossoming. I can see exactly how it's going to happen and where it's going to come from uh, and uh, and could del even delineate it out exactly, just nearly exactly how it's, we're going to go about doing it. Uh, but uh, all of this is going to happen and it's going to happen the same way in the medical field. It's going to happen the same way in the spiritual field and in the consciousness areas and in the light workers and then with the light workers and with the uh, miracle workers and with the with the uh, uh, manifestors and those that uh, uh, those that work with art clearing and all that, it's just going to mushroom into greater and greater and greater uh, energy and greater and greater consciousness. And as we think about those, uh, I uh, for a long time I've uh, studied uh, spectrums and uh, uh, of every kind and I uh, use that in my notes as a, as a symbol of abbreviation for. Uh, uh, the spectrums of uh, uh, whereas I, I would put down the, the, sp the different uh, things that I knew which were, were contained in uh, the spiritual energies and all and I would uh, you know, symbolize that as, as a spectrum knowing that uh, uh, things such as love, joy, peace, uh, gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, temperance against such as no law, Galatians 5.22 knowing that that is a spectrum of which uh, sometimes we uh, pick and choose uh, different uh, 